Good morning and welcome back. Happy New Year. It's been a while since we've um, done any sort of filming. So I'm out today on a new stretch of canal. One I've never fished before, up towards Doncaster. I won't name it. Um, it's supposed to be quite good for a bit of pike fishing, perch fishing. So, you know, we'll see what happens. We're here for today. Again, two dead baits and I've got the low rod, so I might throw that out a little bit. But I'm just starting uh, this little bit here near the dock. I've only got one one dead bait out so far. The, uh, the mackerel tail. I'll slowly start to uh, work my way up. So yeah, looking forward to it. Two new liquids to try from Holy Mackerel. Natural Predator and Red Predator. See if these uh, help anything. Injected into the baits. I've got one. Macro tail on the floor just down here. I've got alleged smelt just down there. Just been talking to a guy and apparently this is the only unfrozen stretch so far. Oh what you can see. So looks like we're staying here. Looks like it's a bait and weight approach, unfortunately. Hmm. But it is what it is. Fingers crossed. We can get a bit of summit going. So another pike angle has actually turned up. He's just fishing the lock to my left. I was literally just going to move, and he said the majority of the canal, other than where we are, is still frozen. So I think it might have to be a bit of a bait and wait kind of day. Um, I was hoping to get some miles in today explore see if we can find some spots because i'm coming back here on monday with chris um for a bit of luring so fingers crossed it's defrosted by then i'm warmed up a little bit more so he's got three rods out i can see all this float so i can see if he catches anything and then i've got my two now i've got the low rod with me but whether i actually use it or not i don't know might give it a blast in a bit see if it'll warm me up a little bit it's not actually that cold, to be fair. It's it got about minus one when I set off, but it don't feel like it. it. Feels quite a bit warmer. I think it is going to be seven or eight degrees today, so we'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. Uh, see if we can get the first pike of the year. But if not, somewhere new, and we can come back and continue to try and catch some uh, pike out of it. We've had some interest in this mackerel tail. Yeah, there we go. And it looks small. Try to get under all this bit of ice here. I thought I'd seen something. Get in there. Seven or eight pound maybe. There we go. First pike of the year. Seven or eight pound ish, I would say. Mackerel tail. Doing a business. Happy days. There we go. First pike of 2023. Quite happy with that. Seven or eight pounder. And half mackerel tail. 
pretty funny to be honest because a little old lady walked past me just as just before I caught it saying oh you're not going to catch nap today lad it's too cold <laughs> but um, now a little further down the bank earlier and then I had to go to the cafe so I could buy my uh, yearbook then I've come back and I saw some bubbling and I thought that looks interesting so I put the mackerel tail back there there were a bit of activity on the float a bit of bobbing and bit of pulling left and right but then nothing so I just cast it a little further and then that were it it was gone so yeah half macro tail on a float <clears throat> happy happy days let's see if we can get another one Through the ice. Well, I was going to move up and go a bit further that way because it looked like it defrosted, but as you've just seen by that boat, absolutely ploughing its way through like the Titanic, not happening. So, back down to the lock. I've only got a couple of hours left anyway, so might just sit it out here and see if we can grab another one. <clears throat> so, at the uh, Joy mackerel on, <clears throat> full one this time. Uh, again, still soaked or injected with the uh, holy mackerel red liquid. Forgotten its name now. But yeah, fingers crossed, next couple of hours, something else will happen. Well, that's it. The end of that session was only a short one. Six, six and a bit hours or so. Uh, not quite what I had planned for today. I was hoping to do uh, a few more miles around the canal and find out a few more spots, but with it being frozen, unfortunately, uh, I had to stick to where it was defrosted. But I can't complain. Seven or eight pound pike, first one of the year, so something to build on. So we'll keep going, we'll keep trying till then, or until next week anyway, when I come with Chris. I'll see you then.